In League of Legends, Thresh is a champion whose abilities allow him to gain stat bonuses, deal damage to enemies, and buff his allies. On today's episode of Law Math, we'll be taking a look at Thresh's abilities and the math behind them. Let's take a look at Thresh's abilities now. Thresh's passive ability, Keeper of Lost Souls, will cause a soul to drop whenever an enemy champion, siege minion, super minion, or large monster dies within 2,000 units of Thresh. Melee and caster minions have about a 20% chance to drop a soul. Whenever Thresh collects a soul, he will be granted armor and ability power equal to 1 minus the amount of souls Thresh already has times 0.01. A soul will will never grant less than 0.5 armor and ability power. Thresh's death sentence ability has a cooldown equal to 19.5 minus the ability's current level times 1.5. It will also cost 80 mana. It will passively cause his auto attack to deal bonus on hit damage equal to the amount of souls Thresh has, plus Thresh's attack damage times 0.05, plus the ability's current level times 0.03, times the amount of seconds since Thresh's last auto attack with a maximum of 10. When activated, Thresh will deal magic damage equal to 50 plus the ability's current level times 30 plus Thresh's ability power times 0.5. When an enemy is hit, they will be stunned for 1.5 seconds and be pulled towards Thresh. The ability can be activated again while an enemy is being pulled and will make Thresh dash towards the stunned unit. Thresh's Dark Passage ability has a cooldown equal to 23.5 minus the ability's current level times 1.5. It will also cost 40 mana. When activated, Thresh will throw his lantern to a target area which will grant all allied champions near it a shield equal to 20, plus the ability's current level times 40, plus Thresh's ability power times 0.4 for 4 seconds. An ally can only be granted 1 shield per ability cast. If an ally clicks on the lantern, they will grab the lantern and dash to Thresh. Thresh's Flay ability has a 9 second cooldown and costs mana equal to 55, plus the ability's current level times 5. When cast, it will deal magic damage in a line, starting from behind his character model, equal to 30, plus the ability's current level times 35, plus Thresh's ability power times 0.4. It will also cause any enemy's hit to be pulled in the direction Thresh casts the ability, and to be slowed by 15% plus the ability's current level times 5%. Thresh's ultimate ability, the box, has a cooldown equal to 160 minus the ability's current level times 10. It will also cost 100 mana. When activated, Thresh will create 5 walls around himself in a pentagon shape. If an enemy champion walks through a wall, they will destroy the wall and be dealt magic damage equal to 100 plus the ability's current level times 150 plus Thresh's ability power. They will also be slowed by 99% for 2 seconds. After a wall is destroyed, the remaining walls will have their damage and slowing potential multiplied by 0.5. This will happen each time a wall is destroyed. Overall, Thresh's soul mechanic, damage dealing potential, and crowd control will definitely make him a strong champion in certain situations. Make sure to like this video if you enjoyed it, and subscribe if you'd like to be informed whenever I release new videos. Click the annotation on the screen if you'd like to see the previous Law Math episode. You can also like Law Math on Facebook at facebook.com slash trampolinetales, and follow me on Twitter at twitter.com slash trampolinetales. Thanks for watching this episode of Law Math.